Hi, welcome to another episode of Classy Pitch. I'm Dr. H. Today we're going to talk about how to disinfect your piano keys. The reason is because of the deadly new coronavirus that everybody's talking about. It spreads quickly around the globe. It spreads from person to person through respiratory droplets, and it can also be transmitted via contaminated surfaces. If you're interested to read more, please see the description area for the links. For us musicians, even if we're afraid of getting sick, it's really not a choice to stop practicing. If you don't have your own piano and you practice at school where everyone shares pianos, then you need to start disinfecting your pianos. And before you start disinfecting your piano keys, you need to wash your hands first. Wash your hands with soap and warm water for 30 seconds. And how long is 30 seconds? Good question. Just sing happy birthday for three times. That's about 30 seconds. And don't forget to do the same after you practice. To disinfect your piano keys, there are two things that you need. A piano cloth and a cleaning solution. You can either make your own cleaning solution with 25% of white vinegar and 75% of water, or just use 90% rubbing alcohol that you can buy in any drugstore. Just so it's easier to control the amount, I put the alcohol into a spring bottle. So I can just spray the rubbing alcohol onto my cloth to dampen my cloth to clean the piano. To clean the keys, dampen your cloth first and wipe the keys vertically. And wipe the white keys first, then the black keys. One thing to keep in mind is not to use alcohol to wipe your keys if they are ivory. To differentiate between plastic and ivory keys is very easy. With ivory keys, each key has two parts. Otherwise, most of the keys are plastic. After we learn how to clean the keys, there are five things that you shouldn't do while cleaning the keys. First, do not use chemical-based cleaners or polish. These cleaners are way too harsh, it will most likely to damage your piano keys. Second, do not use paper towels. Use a lint-free cloth so it won't leave any residue. Third, do not wipe your keys side to side. You risk moisture getting in between the keys and cause more harm. Fourth, do not use the same part of the cloth to wipe the white keys and the black keys. Sometimes the paint can be wiped off from the black keys. If you use the same part to wipe the white keys, you might smear the paint all over the white keys. Fifth, do not spray disinfectants. This can destroy the surface of your piano keys, and the spray itself can carry into the parts of the piano. And while you are practicing, keep the hands off of your face. Don't rub your eyes, don't pick your nose, and don't chew on your nails. And during the flu season, remember to drink plenty of honey lemon water and sleep lots to boost up your immune system. That's it for today's episode. Please share this video with your fellow musicians, and please share your tips of staying healthy in the comment area below. As always, if you have any questions, you can email me at classypitch at gmail.com. You can also find me on Instagram at classypitch. Thanks for watching. Stay healthy, stay classy, and go clean your piano keys.